Okie dokie. Hello! Sorry, I was a bit late there for my own video. So, it may or may not be the end of May. Um, and I haven't done a month in review in a while. So, guess what I'm doing? Yes, I'm doing a month in review and I'm going to do it the normal way. I'm going to do it the way I set it out and the way I intended it to be initially. I need to come up with some really cool like transitions though, so... In... Personal... Why would that be personal? Go away. At the beginning of the month, on April 1st actually, I answered the phone to some number. It wasn't out of area or anything like that and because I'd been getting calls from unis recently I decided to pick it up. You all know this is a big thing for me if you know me or if you've understood anything about any of the videos I've made, especially the people one. That is scary for me. I spoke to him and he was, well, he spoke at me and I answered his questions about my yellow kitchen. He did ask if I was married. Don't know if he was hitting on me. Probably not. But I did say no and yet he still called me Mrs Jones when he hung up. A few days later I went to the Royal Inn Derngate or Royal Ange Derngate. I'm not really sure how to say it or how I have been saying it for this period of time. But it was a theatre that was holding the next round, if you will, of a competition we were doing uh, involving our school and many others for connections, which we sadly didn't get through to the final round of. But it's fine, we had such a good time, or at least I did. I dyed my hair pink, but you guys know that. Me and my drama class had a surprise for my friend. I was gonna say party, but basically, when it was Josh's birthday, we decided that we'd do something, and everyone else was 18. And the, I mean, there are a few 17 year olds, including me. So those 17 year olds didn't come, and I went along, and we just went out for a meal, and then went back to the hotel, and then they went out partying, and I went home. On the same note uh, as the friendship with the drama class thing, we all went to see Romeo and Juliet in London for our exam, sadly, but that's what we did and we had a great time. Well, I did, again. Sometimes get that feeling, you know, when you like people more than they like you. Yeah. And Anna took me shopping for new clothes since I've lost weight. I got four compliments in one day. Now, losing weight and everything, you tend to get compliments quite a lot. Just kidding, I'm not conceited or anything. But this one day, a teacher came up to me and was like, You're wasting away. I'm not entirely sure if that was a compliment, so maybe just three compliments, but she said that to me. Then another teacher came up to me and said, And might I just say you're looking amazing, young lady? I was like, you might. You may. <laughs> then I got a Facebook message the same day saying that I looked smoking. Then I got a text from one of my close friends saying that I looked amazing in my pictures. And it was just a really good confidence boost day because even though I've lost a bunch of weight, I still feel really down sometimes, which is a really bad thing, to be honest, but we've spoken about it. Um, yeah, I have some issues. <laughs> And somewhere in there, I got my driving license as well, my provisional, obviously. I haven't started to learn to drive. I just want it as a form of identification so that when I'm 18, I can buy DVDs. So, in the... I haven't got anything for this one. Media. I should really not quit my day job. Oh, wait, I don't have a job anymore. I started watching Dexter, at least I believe it was this month, because obviously I'm two months or a month behind, I'm not sure, we're still in May, okay, we're still in May, and it's so good, I recommend it, unless you don't like gore. This is kind of a shameful one, but more selfies were taken this month, well, April, because of the confidence that I've sort of found in losing weight, which is a good and a bad thing. Stop shaming my selfie taking, not that you personally are doing that. And the last thing, because I'm so rubbish at this media segment that I made, thinking it would be a great idea and I'd have so much to talk about and remind myself of all the technology and all the news and everything and there's nothing, is the release of the Samsung Galaxy S5, which is so nice. So that's it for this month in review. I will be sure to quickly try and do May because obviously it will be me <laughs> because obviously it will be June soon. 
and then July and then you know you know how the months go okay bye